In this question, we're asked to differentiate y, and y is log of sec x plus tan x. Now over on the right hand side, I've written a few rules that might be useful throughout this question. The first one is the chain rule. We have the differential of sec x, which is sec x tan x, the differential of tan x, which is uh, sec squared x, and when we differentiate log x, we get 1 over x. So we're going to be using the chain rule. So let's start with our u substitution. And the u substitution is to let u equal sec x plus tan x. Now we need to differentiate that. So du by dx. This is where we use our rules. Well, the differential of sec x is sec x tan x. So put that in. So sec x tan x plus the differential of tan x, well, the differential of tan x is sec squared x. So sec squared x. Now I need to pop y in terms of u. So y is now log of u because we've made this substitution in for here. So now we know that dy by du is, well, we know the differential of log x is 1 over x, so the differential of log u is 1 over u. Now we're looking for dy by dx. So using the chain rule, dy by dx is dy by du times du by dx. Okay, so dy by du is 1 over u. And that's multiplied by du by dx, which is this term here. So I'll put that in brackets. So we've got sec x tan x plus sec squared x now 1 over u, well now we can substitute back in for u. So we're going to get sec x tan x plus sec squared x. That's all over u, and u is sec x plus tan x. Now this will actually simplify down a little bit further. If you notice, we've got a factor here of sec x. So what we have is sec x times tan x plus sec x and that's all over sec x plus tan x. Now well, these two are the same so they will cancel so that will cancel with that leaving us with an answer of sec x.